Welcome back to the channel. So I got a breaking news story that I can verbally confirm to you guys right here, right now on the channel. So what you're seeing on screen is an article from CNET's uh, David Loom. I will leave it in the description. So I made a video a few days ago that Verizon might start giving its subscriber base the Apple One service or the Apple One subscription included in the plan, right? At that point, we didn't really know how it, how it was going to be structured. Then shortly after I got word that Verizon may have accidentally leaked a new unlimited plan in their fine print called the one unlimited iPhone. Well, in this video, I'm going to be able to confirm to you guys 100% that plan is going to be announced tomorrow. I was told this as of an hour ago. I don't know the in the entire structure of how and when it will be announced. I don't know if it's going to be before the Apple event, during the Apple event, or after the Apple event. That I am unclear of at this point in time. So of course we'll make a follow-up video, but what I can confirm right now is Verizon is going to start offering two tier premium plans. One is going to be the one unlimited iPhone. That's going to be the Apple tier, right? That's going to be premium. And then the get more will still be around too. And I can also confirm that the pricing structure of the two plans will be the same. It's going to cost you the same for four lines on that new Apple plan as the same price as you would pay for four lines on the get more. That has been confirmed to me. I've seen the listing. A lot of the stuff is floating around on the VCG side. Also, I've been told the OST systems are updating on the store side. That is the promotional tool that the store reps have access to as the, as the new promotions roll in. And that will be updated, I'm, I'm told, very soon. I don't know if, it, if that's still today or tomorrow. I'm waiting to hear back. But that's what I've been told. So they're separating the, uh, the premium side, right? They're making a premium unlimited plan for Apple users or iPhone users, I should say. And then the get more plan will be around still as well. Now, here's, here's another thing that's been confirmed to me. The, the Apple, the iPhone plan will not be a part of the mix and match. So if you want the new Apple perks, the Apple one subscription, they will not be a part of the get more plan. So if you want that new Apple plan, you have to move your entire account over to it. It cannot just be one line or two lines. You have to move the entire account to this new one unlimited for iPhones. The entire account has to be moved. And as you move that entire account, you will lose all the perks that come with the get more plan. So just keep that in mind. That's already been confirmed to me. Now, a few things, like I said, that are still not clear right now. Is there anything else additionally that they're going to offer on this new iPhone plan? Could there could they include yearly upgrades for free or automatically that remains to be seen right like i said there's going to be a follow-up to this with the official documents but that's what's been confirmed to me right now the pricing structure is the same as the get more you will get the apple one subscription the entire subscription apple music apple tv the cloud storage the news everything that comes with the apple one will be included on that iPhone unlimited plan, uh, according to what's been told to me. The reason I'm making this video is because this, this is hot like this, this is actually going to happen. Like this is not some, some leaks, some rumors, some maybes. No, this has been officially confirmed to me from documentation internally. So once the OST has been updated and I get that document still today, then of course I'll make an update and we can go through that document. But for everything else, we will have to wait on tomorrow's announcement. Like I said, I don't know how that announcement will be structured. We'll have to wait on that. But I have been, it's been officially confirmed to me that this new iPhone plan is happening and it will be announced alongside uh, with the iPhone 14 launch that's uh, going to be announced tomorrow from Apple. Now, just briefly to conclude the video, does this move the needle for Verizon? I don't know. I don't know if adding an, an additional unlimited plan to your portfolio 
is going to break down your doors, right? A lot of people that I'm seeing now, I can I can final, finally anecdotally speak on this from all the comments that I've received. Again, that's still a small sample size. You got to keep that in mind. A lot of people want cheaper plants. And this is not just from the the reoccurring watchers on the channel that that watch and comment consistently. No, this is like new people, new names that I'm seeing. Hey, I've been on Verizon. I chose T-Mobile because they're too expensive. And I'm seeing that reoccurring more often. It's still, like I said, a small sample size, but I can anecdotally speak now that people want cheaper prices. And this new unlimited plan that they're including, that they're going to include, is not going to cost any less than the get more. Like I said, that pricing structure is the same. With auto pay, it's going to be $90 for a single line and without the auto pay it's going to be a hundred same as the get more no different i've seen the pricing structure up to five lines it is the exact same as the get more so like i said i don't know if that's going to move the needle for verizon we'll, we'll see if we get any other tidbits on the actual official announcement but for now this is what i have that i wanted to share with you guys so be prepared for that announcement tomorrow like I said, they are, they are splitting the premium plans into two plans. So you can choose now between the Apple perks or the Get More. Now, I know the Get More has the Apple Music on it. I don't know if that will remain on the Get More plan. We will know more about that tomorrow. I will try to ask around today. If I do find out, I will leave, the, uh, I will leave a tweet on my Twitter as an update to see if that Apple Music will remain on the Get More. But for now... That's what we know. Two separate premium unlimited plans, one for iPhones. And I would assume you could still get to get more if you want to, even if you want to get the iPhone 14. That's uh, that's what I'm assuming. But if you want the entire Apple experience with the Apple one for the Apple users, you can do so now starting tomorrow with Verizon. So let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below. I look forward to reading all your comments on this. Make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. Like, share, subscribe. Follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. I will see you in the next one. Peace.